and welcome to my channel. My name is Prue or Prue LaRue and today I thought I'll do a Valentine's Day a Valentine's Day look with the Norvina palette from Anastasia Beverly Hills. So I'm hoping I can get this up on Valentine's Day for you lovely people in the US. It is Valentine's Day for me right now and it is 7 p.m. at night. <laughs> but you know. So I'm gonna chuck love all the way up here. So I just finished night shift this morning. I sat down to film another look, but I realized I really, I've got the Jeffree Star mystery box to unbox. And I didn't wanna, and I've been wanting to do a Valentine's Day look. And that's just where my inspo led me. So I hope you don't mind. And I hope this looks pretty. So I hope you guys are having a great happy Valentine's Day. I'm so confused by social media. Because, like, I didn't realise it was still a big thing past high school, to be honest. But there's plenty of Valentine's Day stuff to be bought everywhere. So I guess a lot of people are still celebrating it. Oh, I still don't, I don't take the sticker off. Oh. So I guess a lot of people are out there buying Valentine's Day gifts and I did I did get one. I got a beautiful Starbucks mug. I've already had like three coffees from it. Anyway, let me know how your Valentine's Day was. What you got to? Is it Valentine's Day where you are now? Was it yesterday? Are you watching this in the future? I think it's a strange holiday. Hmm. That look colour is a bit Oh, you are very sorry. The colour is a bit more than I thought it was going to be. I had a plant, but the red is a bit more. I don't, I'm going to do what it was. So I'm going to go on to Passion, the shade here. So let me know if you still celebrate Valentine's Day. I'm super curious. I feel like with makeup, you sort of see it everywhere because everyone's been doing these amazing Valentine's Day looks. And they're very much the pink looks. And just from everything I've seen on my Instagram feed, really made me want... To play with this palette so I'd love to know what kind of makeup you've been loving if you've been seeing all these pink purple looks around is there a palette that you've just been wanting to pick up so going into wild gel so. oh and if you're in Australia or even if you're in the US, have you been, how do you feel about Married at First Sight? We just have it, the, I think it's like the second or third season, playing in Australia at the moment. And everyone at work is going crazy over it. I just caught up. <laughs> it is pretty mental. I feel like I really want to put Celestial on my inner corner. I don't know if I regret this or not. But I don't know if you do like Married at First Sight. I'd love to hear any of your thoughts or opinions. Um, I was reading some forums about the Australian one last night and there's actually quite a lot of people who watch the Australian one because they prefer it, like in the US, they prefer it to the US one because legally ours, like, they don't get married in the version here. They have the ceremony, but you legally can't get married in Australia unless you give 30 days notice. So it's like a fake wedding and then they have dinner parties every week with all the couples in the experiment. Oh, and it, it's kind of hilarious. Then I'm going to, might as well use the same brush I was just using. I really feel like using Sol. So I've just been catching up and watching occasional vid episodes because so many of my, like so many people at work are talking about it. I've been wanting to know. So let me know if you if you love watching Married at First Sight too. Um, I have tried watching the US one before, but I don't know, it, it didn't catch my attention as like the Australian one does. Let's go in to something in the waterline. I feel like Prance from Colourpop in the waterline today. Oh. Which is like the baby blue, but mine is breaking a little bit. Alright, 
So I'm just going to quickly go off camera and do a little bit of liner just at the bottom of my lashes and mascara and I'll be back. Alright, so I just put the Fenty Fly Liner and the Colourpop BFF mascara on and I did mess the liner up on this eye a little bit, but oh well. This one looks a little better. Anyway, this is like my little mini attempt at my Valentine's Day look. I'll bring you in close. You can judge. This is this is the good one. This is the bad one. But I think together it doesn't look too bad. <laughs> anyway, thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed. And I very much just did my base as like very blush, a very blushed look. And I haven't done any bronzer or highlighter. So I thought it'd be like more of a flushed little I'm in love look. <laughs> anyway, I had a lot of fun pulling out my Norvina palette. It's been a little while since I played with this baby. And it's nice just to do a like pretty pink look. And yeah. I think I kind of want to play with this a little bit more. Let me know what you think. And I'd absolutely love to know what you got up to on Valentine's Day. What is... Do you celebrate it? What did you do instead? Uh, did you just go to work like a normal person? <laughs> and do let me know any and all opinions you have about married and married at first sight. Thank you so much for watching. I absolutely appreciate and adore you. Mm.